our patient presented with a chief complaint of lower back pain. And from our physical exam, our working diagnosis is lumbar disc herniation. Our physical exam showed a positive straight leg raise on the right leg and a positive tender right piriformis upon rotation. The patient exhibited severe pain with radiculopathy and had a tender right lumbar region upon palpation around the level of L3. Our working differential diagnosis included cauda equina and conus medullaris, which we ruled out because there was no history of incontinence, impotence, saddle paresthesias, or neurological deficits, and the physical exam correlated with these findings. The spinal stenosis was ruled out because there was no history of a previous back pain. There was no tenderness upon the SI joint within the physical exam, so we ruled out sacroiliitis. We also ruled out ankylosing spondylitis because it typically presents with a pain pattern where the pain increases with rest and decreases with activity. Fractures were also ruled out due to the, that the patient had no history of trauma, osteoporosis, and he did not present with point tenderness upon physical exam. Metastatic cancer was also ruled out because he did not present with fatigue, malaise, history cancer, or, his, or unremitting, unremitting pain, especially at night. Triple A was also on the differential. However, the patient did not exert any abdominal pain and his aortic diameter and pulse was within normal limits. Osteomyelitis uh, also was ruled out because the patient did not have any indications of infection during his exam. He denies any past fever, malaise, recent illness, or IV drug use. 